Hey everybody, it's Georgina. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I am going to be reorganizing my whole entire makeup collection and I'm super excited about this video because these are my favorite type of videos to watch. So I thought I would take you guys along with me on this super long journey. <laughs> already start with organizing my makeup but i will tell you guys where i'm at right now so these drawers right here behind me as you guys can see that used to be my only storage for me to put my makeup in but i have a lot a lot of makeup and it just did not fit in those two drawers anymore so i decided to go ahead and go to ikea and i purchased a set of small alex drawers which is this little baby right here so I got that from Ikea to store even more makeup <laughs> and I also um, ordered some organizers off of Amazon but I also just got a package which is right there. I'm gonna unbox it with you guys on camera um, which is even more organizers because I ordered organizers off of Amazon but they weren't enough for like all of the drawers so I'm gonna unbox those right now and I just want to get started it is time to unbox even more makeup organizers so I want to say that these makeup organizers have been gifted to me by a company called a twall I think on Instagram I think it's a twy or a twall you can read it right here it's upside down but whatever um, I posted an Instagram story that I got these drawers right here that I'm balancing my camera on right now and they were like we would love to send you some organizers so I was like that is perfect I would love that I have a lot of organizers right here this is what they come like like they come in a box I'm pretty sure they gave me um, lipstick organizers but also like compact organizers so this is the first one I have another one like that and then oh another one and then these two are for lipsticks which are kind of like a little bit smaller and I think what you do is you kind of build them yourself so i guess that's what i'm about to do right now it kind of took a little while to get everything out of the packaging and the plastic that it came in um but you do build them yourself but it's super super easy so i think you start with two of the long ones on each side and then get a smaller one and then just hook it in there i think so these do all fit perfectly um, into Alex drawers. I believe that, I mean, these are like specifically made to go in Alex drawers. So that is like perfect. And I think you just put them in like this. Like I actually have no idea. I think it goes like that. Okay, so I put some long ones in, so I'm going to show you guys. So you can put even more long ones in here to make like really, really small square um, places to like put your lipsticks in. But I think I'm going to leave it like this with a little bit more room because I do have a lot of lip glosses, lip liners, and not really too much like small bullet lipsticks if that makes sense let me show you guys what we have right now so i did finish building all of them let me just say that these were so easy to put together they are also completely customizable so you can basically install them however you want them to be um which is perfect because obviously everyone has different makeup products like all makeup products are different sizes and everything so this was just so so perfect so um i did label all of mine so please do not laugh at me but i did so i'm going to show you guys what mine look like so i made this one for all of my compacts so blushes highlighters um and bronzers this one is for foundation concealers and setting sprays this one is a little bit taller i don't know if you guys can see this one is a little bit lower this one's a little bit higher so you have that for that this is eye stuff um brows and single shadows so here are the single shadows gonna go and then this is eyeliners and everything and eyebrow pencils and whatnot this one right here it says lip stuff um i built this one the same as this one for my eye stuff so right here in those little compartments is where the lipsticks are gonna go and then right here maybe some glosses um liquid lipsticks that don't fit in 
those tiny ones and lip glosses and everything. And then that one is for palettes, eyeshadow palettes, highlighter palettes, whatever. So yeah, I did label mine, which is kind of funny, but I don't know. I just like to be super organized. So I'm going to put everything in the drawers right now but some of you might be wondering where all of my makeup is right now so i'm gonna show you guys uh, my makeup is basically just all in these drawers already but these are old dividers that i had um from when i had my makeup in different drawers there's also just like makeup here in super random things just like thrown in here because i obviously did not want everything just laying in one big mess if that makes sense so i mean it's still a big mess but i'm gonna take everything out now and organize it finally these are all of my makeup palettes and i'm gonna put them in the bottom drawer right now okay let's do this i have a lot of square palettes like this that i'm just gonna put in the back of the drawer This is a quick look at all of my palettes right now. Some things still might change. Um, unfortunately, this palette, which is my recent palette from Nikki Tutorials, did not fit in here, which is kind of sad, but this is what it looks like for now. And now let's get on to compacts. So this is going to be compacts. I do have a lot of them, so I'm just hoping that I will have enough space. This is my compact so far. I do have a few more left, but I'm just gonna see in the end how I can organize it better. I don't know, but this is it for now. And now on to foundation, concealer, and setting spray. I'm gonna put all of my foundations, I think, on one side, starting from here. I don't have too many foundations, to be honest, so. Next to it, I'm gonna put all of my contour sticks. And next to that, all of my blush sticks. I'm now going to move on to this one, which is lip stuff. This is most of my lip stuff. I'm going to put the um, lipsticks in the back or like more in the back right here. I'm gonna put longer lip glosses in the front. Now we are at the top, which is going to be eye stuff, eyebrows, and single eyeshadows. These are all of my single shadows and um, liquid eyeshadows and stuff like that and glitters and everything. Okay guys, so I just finished with putting all of my makeup in my new drawer, so I thought why not 
give you a tour. So I do have to say before I show you guys um, how everything looks right now, I would say that this is around 90, 95, I don't know, I think like 90% of my makeup collection just because I do have some stuff that is at my boyfriend's house. So this is not everything but it is almost everything. So let's start right here at the top. So this does pull out really, really far. I'm just gonna start out at the back. So in the back, in the first drawer right here, I have all of my single shadows, which is mostly ColourPop. I have one NYX shadow right here. These are shadow bases, and these are just ColourPop single shadows. Then right here, I have all of my liquid eyeshadows from Beauty Bay. These are by far my favorite liquid eyeshadows ever. Um, it does kind of bother me that these are bigger than my single shadows, but I don't really reach for these too much. I do really use these ones a lot, so it just made more sense to put these more towards the front. Then I have these ColourPop glitter liners and this one from Essence. Then I'm just gonna back up a little bit and right here in these two um, containers, I have all of my mascaras. Right here is all of my eyeliners and this is brow stuff. So right here, hold on, this is not very, very neat. Right here is all of my brow stuff. So so brows, um, mostly like benefit stuff. This just like random eyebrow pencils. And right here is all of my eyelash glues, which is not super exciting. The second drawer is obviously all lip products. I have my longer lip glosses in the back right here, which is mostly Iconic London. We have some e.l.f., H&B Cosmetics. Then I have all of my lipsticks right here. I don't have too many, so I just put them all right here. And then I have some of my shorter lip glosses. So I have all of my Fenty. Um, this is still a random lipstick. I have my lip oils from ColourPop. ColourPop, more ColourPop, NARS. Um, yeah, these are kind of like lip, I don't really know what to call them, lip tints, I guess. Then more towards the front, these two are liquid lipsticks um, with my weird Fenty one right here. I don't really know where to put it. These are all of my lip liners and then these are all of my NYX soft matte lip creams. I do also have this um, lip primer right here stuffed to the side. Next drawer, and this is kind of messy because, I mean, everything is different shapes. There's lots of stuff in here, foundation, concealer, um, setting sprays, blush, um, bronzer, everything. So right here in the first row, I kind of worked um, vertically. I don't know if that's how you say it, but these are all of my foundations and BB creams. Then in the next row, I have all of my concealers. Um, next, Tarte. What is this? Urban Decay, Too Faced, this random Catrice concealer. Then right here I have all of my, um, what's it called? Next to that I have all of my stick and liquid bronzers, highlighters, and blushes. So first I have my um, bronzers, then blushes, then some highlighters, and then here to the side I have some setting sprays and primers. I'm gonna move this up a little bit. So this is kind of the section where I have like some stuff laying at my boyfriend's house. So this is not 100% complete, but this is what it looks like right now. In the next one, I have most of my ColourPop blushes right here shoved in the back. So I started, um, well, I try to start with all of my blushes. So my blushes are to here, I think. Then I have some highlighters, then we have setting powders, and then we are on to bronzers. Again, these are all different brands. Um, I have a lot of ColourPop blushes, but my highlighters are all different brands. I don't know, Becca, Fenty Beauty, Sol Beauty, Artist Couture, setting powders also from different brands. Um, Huda Beauty, Flower Bakery, I think it's called. Oh, Beauty Bakery, Essence, just all random things. So these are all of my compacts. Um, highlighters, blushes, setting powders, and bronzers. This is the last one, and I'm sorry for this weird angle. You can kind of see what I'm balancing my camera on, but this one is packed, and I actually have one palette that did not fit in here, which was my Nick Tutorials palette, but it was way too big to fit into my Alex drawer. So in here, I have mostly eyeshadow palettes, but also contour palettes and highlighter palettes and blush palettes. These are basically all of my palettes. So starting from, oh my gosh. 
I can't even see like all the way in the back right here like after these palettes are my ColourPop square palettes then just some uh, random eyeshadow palettes we have Lime Crime, Beach Cosmetics, Beauty Bay this is hold on what is this Beauty Bay again Beach Cosmetics Be Perfect Kat Von D um, contour palette, Anastasia contour palette, Sam Marcel highlighter palette, these three ColourPop eyeshadow palettes, Too Faced Puppy palette, which is my um, cutest palette. I have my Juvia's Place palettes right here. I have three. Um, Anastasia, Anastasia, Too Faced, Laura Geller, and Urban Decay Naked Heat. I am sorry for this cord, but I'm just charging my camera. Um, maybe some of you are wondering what I'm going to do with my two drawers that are now almost empty. As I said, my palette, like my Nikki palette, did not fit in here, so I put it right there, as well as some setting sprays that were also too tall for my Alex drawer. And I have my beauty sponges and some brushes over here. Um, I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with this yet, but yeah. But with this one, this is going to be my new skincare drawer. So if you guys still want to see some more organizing, then definitely keep on watching because I am going to organize this right now because this is all of my skincare right here. And as you can see, this also does not fit in here anymore. So I am going to make this my skincare drawer and let's get on to organizing again. I hope you guys can still kind of see what I'm doing but here is where all of my skincare is going to be. So I'm just going to go ahead and kind of start with putting it all in here. I don't really have a plan. I'm just going to see what fits and we will just see how it turns out. I really have no idea. <laughs> ready for a skincare tour um again i do not have all of my skincare products in here most of it is downstairs in the bathroom like cleansers and stuff because i use that daily in the bathroom so right here in these two compartments on the side they are filled with cleansers i have a lot of fourth ray beauty stuff mario badescu beauty bay and skin deva Right here, I have two cleansers that I have not tried out yet. So, I mean, I have tried this, but I haven't tried this one. So, I just put them right there. Um, right here, I have three toners. Beauty Bay, Pixie, Fourth Ray Beauty. These are just some teeth whitening strips. All the way in the back over there, that orange thing is a mask by Freck. I have my aloe vera um, hand sanitizer. I have my micro needle um, stuff roller thingy. What's it called? Derma? No, I, I'm i Derma Roller? I don't even know anymore. Um, and my Jade Roller. Then I have this mask. It's just kind of like all random stuff. Mask, um, face mist, which I'm pretty sure is almost empty. Um, face cream, I have some face masks over here. Lip scrub, eye cream, castor oil. This one, this thing is filled with coconut oil. Um... Again, some more serums right here. Um, this is Beauty Bay, Fourth Ray Beauty, Beauty Bay, Mario Badescu, Elemi, Elemis, and then my deodorants. Hey guys, it's Georgina from the future. So I was editing this video and I noticed that I did not tell you guys what I ended up doing with this one right here, this drawer. I turned it into my hair drawer um, with makeup sponges on the side. <laughs> I just put these here because I didn't have anywhere else to put them so they're in my hair drawer okay um so i have all of my hair bobbles hair ties right here i have some hair clips for when i do my curls and i kind of want to you know clip them in place i have bobby pins and like smaller clips right right here i have a hair donut i have my scrunchie collection how cute is this one i got this from victoria's secret when i was in the uk last week I'm so obsessed with it. I love leopard print. 
Um, right here I have my hair brushes, this comb from Beauty Works, this brush from Beauty Works, and then my Tangle Teaser. This is just um, volume powder. And in here I have a big clip for my hair and then these mini little rubber hair ties and this random extension that I sometimes use. And then all the way in the back, I don't know if you guys can see, is um, hair rollers. They're from Primark. They're like very big hair rollers. I just put them in the back. So yeah, that's what I ended up doing with this one. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed organizing with me. I just love organizing, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm pretty sure this video was long as F. So I'm sorry. So if you liked it, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, turn on your post notifications, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.